Yo fam, welcome back to Wear Flex. Thank you all for taking time out your busy day to check out yet again another one of my videos. And if this is your first time, stick around to the end. And if you like what you see in here, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, and you might as well smash that notification bell while you're at it. Okay guys, so we all know FunCon 2021 just ended. Uh, so this is basically a wrap up video of my FunCon 2021. So let's get right into it. So first off, I did enter the box of fun lottery and I did win as you can see here. So this is basically the stuff that I got inside that box and I just got in my second box. So if you guys don't know, the box of fun this year came in two parts. Part one was your team stuff and part two was the mystery Freddy Funko set everybody's going crazy about and I just got that box in so stay tuned later in the video and you're gonna see exactly what I got so let's start off with the stuff that came in the box so of course I had to pick sorry about that it's, it's my dog over here scratching but uh anyways I picked Fanatic Fury so let's go ahead and see what that comes with so all of this stuff came in one box. Um, it's gonna open some of this stuff. You've probably seen this many times before, uh, but you know, I'm just gonna show you. So I definitely went with Fanatic Fury. Uh, blue and white are, you know, two of my favorite colors. Uh, so I had to pick this up. Also, the mascot to me just looks really dope. But uh, of course, we came. It came with the bandana for the team. I'm gonna show you guys. What this looks like, here you go. It says Fun Days 2021 on there, Fun Day Games, and it has uh, the Fanatic Fury mascot on there. Pretty cool blue and white bandana, I think. Um, I can use this for something later. <laughs> but uh, also inside there, I don't even know what these things are called. These are like, these are like the little Bam Bam sticks that you see at games. Uh, I'm not gonna open it right now just because you gotta like inflate it and whatnot so i'm not gonna do that but anyways those are the little inflatable sticks that make noise <laughs> okay so that's oh also can't forget about the pin i think this is a pin yeah so this is a pretty cool looking pin um i already like the pin i like the backer as well i'm not sure if you can see that there probably closer here you can see it but that is the Fnatic Fury logo right there. Pretty cool to me, so uh, I definitely have to pick that up. All right, so that's all that came in the little envelope. Now, um, it also came with a, a pop podium, which is something new uh, Funko was doing. I just, they just did it this year because this was the, uh, this year was the Olympics. Uh, it's 2021, but it's the 2020 Olympics. Um, but we get this nice pop podium in there. I think this one is this one is special because it only came in these fun days boxes. Uh, so it's it's black and gold. It's pretty nice. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Guess a nice little display for your pops if you want to put them on your shelf somewhere. I probably will be using this somewhere. But uh, it's it's nicely made. It's not doesn't feel like really cheap at all. And as you can see, you got first, second, and third. So yeah, it's a pretty cool display for uh, your shelves. I'll put it up there somewhere. Okay, so now let's get into the pops that we got in the first box. So one of the first pops we got was Torchy. Um, it's basically a pop Olympic torch. That's 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 as best as I can say. You can see it there. It's pretty. It's a cool looking pop. Kind of reminds me of like the spastic line. Speaking of, haven't really seen any seen too many spastic uh, spastic plastic pops. Hmm. Maybe they got a hint. <laughs> but anyways, that take a look at the virtual Fun Funko um, limited edition sticker right there. It's pretty cool. Red, white, and blue, of course, in the uh, Team USA Olympic style. But uh, that's the first pop that we got. All right, next pop is a two pack, which is Brian Mariotti and uh, Mike Becker, which is pretty cool. 
Um, they're like uh, fun day games announcers, you know, like you would see at Olympic announcers or whatnot. But it's a two pack. Um, this is pretty dope. Uh, this is uh, gonna go along well with my uh, Brian Mariotti uh, um, with the that making fun um, documentary DVD that pack. So that's that's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, so Brian Mariotti and Mike Becker. Pretty cool. Take one more look at it there. Yeah, pretty dope pops, I think. All right, so this next one here is the team mascot and it came in a sorter box which is pretty dope i don't know why the other one didn't but uh, anyways and then it also comes in this nice little orange box here so the teams were for fun days you had funko force you had pop rangers you have proto punks and you have fanatic fury and of course i went with fanatic fury so Let's go ahead and pop this open and see how this mascot looks in person. And guys, if you watched the Fun Days uh, video, you guys already know that the team that won was actually Pop Rangers, and the freaking Fanatic Fury didn't place at all. They were in dead last. Crazy, crazy, crazy. But uh, let's go ahead and pop this open. Uh, take a look at that. It's a dope pop. And all of the team pops were limited to 5,000 pieces, which is pretty cool. Oh man, looking at this up close and personal is pretty dope. I'm still glad I picked the uh, Fanatic Fury. I really went off of the colors and the way that the uh, mascot looked because this is a really dope pop. I mean, it's a freaking tornado with a crown. Like, come on now, it doesn't get more dope than that. But yeah, so 5,000 pieces, guys. Here's Fanatic Fury. There's a storm brewing at Funko Fun Days with a 100% chance of lightning and thunder. Any team that wants to tangle with this twister should worry, because it's because it goes by the name of Fanatic Fury. Okay, all that talk, but we still got last place. Anyways, so that is the last pop that came in the first pack, first box of the fun days so I'll go ahead and take a look at them there all right so like I said I have my second box here with my Freddy Funkos and I'm super ready to get into it because I've been seeing so much on the internet about what people are getting like HR Puff and stuff Freddy as Freddy Mercury uh, Jolly Bee Skull Trooper I mean just a, a, a huge list of things and then I've been seeing a lot of people uh, complain about, you know, they're getting like the silver and bronze Freddy Funko. I'm really excited to get whatever. Um, there's a few things that I really, really looking for, but if I don't get them, I mean, it's okay. I mean, last year, was that last year? I don't know, but the last box of fun that I actually got, I got a really nice grill out of it. Okay, so like I said, the last fun days box, I pulled this nice grill out of it. It was the uh, metallic um it was freddy funko as genie and it was the metallic version they had this version and then they had a regular version and yeah so as you can see i have this in the pop shield armor because you know grail status <laughs> okay so now let's take a look at these freddy funkos okay so here is the box that the freddy funkos came in um yeah so it's just a simple box it just says one piece assorted box of fun w2 two blue shoe box Funko 63237. I've seen so many people in their conspiracy uh, theories out there about the numbers on the box and whatnot. My box doesn't even have that information on there. As you can see, it's just this, okay? There's nothing else. That's it, just Funko and this. I already took off the labels that show my address, so, and that didn't have any information but my information on it. So, let's go ahead and get into this box. All right, guys. Let me know in the comment section below if you um, already got your box, second box with your Freddy Funkos, and let me know what you guys picked up. And if you didn't, let me just let me know in the comment section below what would which Freddy Funkos would you have liked to receive. Okay, so see the box here. Um, there's brown paper in there, and then there's the box. 
the shoe box. Okay, so about this shoe box, this is really freaking dope. I always say this, I love great packaging, and I think this shoe box packaging is just so legit. Like, and it reminds me of the something you may have seen on my channel recently, the uh the OG Blue Adidas uh tech figures. They all came in shoe boxes similar to this. Um, so this is pretty dope. I'm excited to get into these uh, Freddy Funkos. So let's go ahead and stop talking and get into this box. Look at, I mean, I mean, just look at that dope packaging. Look at that. That is so cool. I love it. They really went all out with this. So I'm gonna go ahead and slice it right here at the bottom and just start peeling away. Guys, I'm excited. I don't know, I'm, I'm just excited. It's, I haven't had, I haven't had like a mystery box in a while. So this is like a mystery box and it's it's been a minute. So like true mystery box style, I'm gonna go ahead and just open it and just not look. Like I, I've, I've, I've seen that a lot that they're covered in paper. So I'm just gonna go ahead, rip the paper off and I'm going to tilt it to try to get this one out. Okay, that was that was easier than a lot of people made it seem. Okay, so I'm not gonna look. I'm gonna rip the paper off. Okay, okay, okay. I think this is the top. Okay, so this, okay, here we go guys. First one, here we go. Whew, Hershey, I'm excited. Are you excited, Hershey? I'm excited. All right guys, here we go. In three, two, one okay okay so the first one i pull is the uh white on blue artist series 2000 piece uh freddie funko um take a look at it there it's it's cool i like the colors i love the colors blue and white um but i mean it's an artist series hopefully there's only one artist series in this box and I, because I've seen people get two artist series and then a bronze or a silver, but hopefully there's one. The The pop is in really good condition. Uh, go ahead, take a look at it again. So that is the blue and white artist series for Eddie Funko. I mean, it's a clean pop. It's 2,000 pieces. Um, my favorite colors. So yeah, so that's, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna put that there. Okay guys, two more. I'm hoping I don't have another artist series. Like, I don't want the, the, the blue on white one either. And I definitely don't want the brown on white. That makes no sense to me whatsoever. So let's go ahead. Ah, man. Okay, okay, okay. I was like, you know, a lot of people are, are receiving the artist series. So there has to be at least one artist series in there. So let's hopefully we got that out the way. Um, here we go. Second one. Woo! I'm nervous, guys. I'm nervous. In three, two, one. Who did I get? Woo! Okay, so I got Freddy Funko as Wolfman. This isn't the t this isn't the um, the flogged version. That's okay. This is a uh, three thousand pieces. Pretty cool. So of course this is from the Universal Monsters uh, Wolfman. Uh, many of you may know about Wolfman, but anyways, so this one they have this common version right here. I would I would say common, it's exclusive, but um, it's 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 the less it's more common than the other one. The other one is flopped. So I have Freddy Funko as Wolfman. I haven't really seen too many of this one. I've seen a lot of the flocked version, um, but yeah. So that is Freddy Funko as Wolfman. Okay. Last one, okay, fingers crossed is not another art series. Okay, guys, last but not least, okay. Woo, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, here's the front of the box. Whew. Last one, guys. Three, two, one. What is it? Whoa, okay. I haven't really seen this one. Okay, it's an artist series. Dang, I have two artist series. But this one's like, uh, this is a thousand piece artist series. 
and it's like mint chocolate chip. It's like a brown Freddy Funko with like teal crowns on them. Um, so it, it definitely reminds me of mint chocolate chip. But uh, yeah, guys, so those are my three Freddy Funkos. I got two artist series, white on blue and teal on brown Freddy Funkos. Uh, so one is 2,000 pieces, one is 1,000 pieces, and the last one is Wolfman at 3,000 pieces. Okay, guys. Um, yeah, so that wraps up my FunCon. Besides these, uh, the, the box of fun, I did pick up a Fat Gum and uh, a Squirtle Funko Pop from uh, GameStop, but uh, that was the only... That was about it. I picked all oh, and I picked up a game orchid. Those are the only three I really wanted this con. It wasn't too many pops that I really wanted, but uh, yeah, guys. And also, something really cool during the fun days uh, premiere video, uh, I actually won a prize from Funko. So I'm I'm super excited. I don't know what it is. Some people are saying it's a proto, I'm, it could be a full run of the pops that they uh, released for FunCon. I don't know. They said it'll take about six plus weeks, so. Uh, I guess I'll do an update video when I get that prize in. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And bang that notification bell so you all get notified when I upload new videos just like this one today. And always stay weird and stay flexing. Peace.